Uh, my name is Harris Rothschild. I'm the manager and head instructor here at St Ives Surf School. Uh, our surf school is based on Portmere Beach, directly in front of the iconic Tate Gallery. And we also now have a water sports centre located on Portminster Beach, which is directly in front of the St Ives train station. The surf school based on Portmere, sort of a west facing beach where we get all of our swell here in Cornwall. And we teach surf lessons uh, every day throughout the season from end of March to the beginning of November. We've got top quality equipment, so stuff like 4mm wetsuits so you keep really warm over the in the colder months of the year. Boots, gloves, even hats to keep your head warm. So there's no excuses for anyone now really. So at the moment today, as you can see behind me there, we've got a um, beginners and improvers surf lesson going on. So some of those guys have been with us for several lessons this week and sort of on fifth, fourth or fifth lesson, further developing their skills they've already learned, things like turning, slowing down, speeding up, more advanced surfing techniques. And then you've got the other end of the spectrum, people who's very first time, potentially the first ever time in the sea, learning sort of basic surfing techniques in a beginner surf lesson. Quite often run courses, sort of five day courses for people who don't just want to experience surf and they really want to uh, generate some skills over the week. Start off as a beginner surfer in the white water and after on their fifth day you might see them out the back with some of the local guys trimming on the waves left and right. Our kayak tours, a bit more uh, chilled out activity, get to travel around some eyes from the water, perhaps something they get to do very often, look back on the famous landmarks like the island, the Tate Gallery, from a different perspective, much more peaceful. Quite often you see dolphins and seals playing around in the water and it's just a real unique uh, experience out there. We also uh, introduced new activities such as stand-up paddleboarding and co-steering uh, the last few years, becoming really popular. Stand-up paddleboarding is a great way to exercise um, and it's just a really good fun I would, personally, I think it's a lot easier than surfing. It's a flat water activity um, and a slightly easier at entry level. Co-steering is quite a new, new activity people are not too aware of. It involves swimming, climbing and jumping around the, the coastline in a very safe environment. We provide buoyancy aids, helmets, wetsuit boots, full kit from children from 12 up to adults of 65, 70 years old all having fun. Minimum requirement is 50 meters swimming in open water and after that you're good to go. St Ives we're very lucky, I mean Cornwall in general has got so much going for it. Personally I'm massively biased, everything I do evolves around the sea and I think most of my friends and the guys that work for us have very similar passions. So for people visiting the area it's almost a must do is experience the, the joys and the fun of the ocean. I feel that if I was in the water with a board, I think I could probably ride a few waves by myself now. Um, uh, was it fun? Yeah, it was really fun. I would do it again every day. The level of detail that the instructor gave, you go one by one through everyone, you really feel like the experience is personalised to you. Um, well, I just like standing up. And I, I like standing up and going with the wave. It's probably my favourite thing. It was just exhilarating to just be on the board and then as soon as you're sort of trip, you know, you're learning how to turn the wave, turn into the wave, it's fantastic. It just feels, you sort of start to accelerate it.